Pakistan remains under increased monitoring. The Pakistan government has two concurrent action plans with a total of 34 action plan items. It has now addressed or largely addressed 30 of the items. Its most recent action plan from June this year, which largely focused on money laundering deficiencies, was issued after FATF's regional partner, APG, the Asian Pacific Group, identified a number of serious issues. Overall, Pakistan is making good progress on this new action plan. Four of the seven action plan items are now addressed or largely addressed. This includes showing that financial supervisors are conducting on-site and off-site checks on non-financial sector businesses and enacting legislative amendments to improve international cooperation. So um, on the action plan uh, of Pakistan from 2019, uh, we require Pakistan to demonstrate that terrorist financing investigations and prosecutions are targeting senior leaders and commanders of UN designated terrorist groups and their associates. That's the requirement. Um, and uh, you were asking about, about blacklisting. I just mentioned in my introductory statement that uh, Pakistan um, has already completed 30 action items out of um, 34. So this shows the clear commitment of the Pakistani government. Um, so um, there is no discussion uh, about a blacklisting of the country. Uh, the government is cooperating with the FATF and we urge the country to very quickly address the remaining four uh, items of the action plans. ABP Sonja, Josh Jasper, Janu.